I'm going to repair one of these light curtains. Now these are used for dog sports, like dog agility. It's part of a farm tech timer system. These are the short bars, you've got different lengths. These are the short ones, you've got longer ones as well. Now these have a fault. These got given to me as part of a test because someone has some problem with the range and sensing on their unit. And I discovered that one of these light curtains have a problem as well. So I'm going to show you that problem. It's currently powered up. You can't really see the EDs and actually an ED up here, which is green. I'm going to turn these lights off so you can see it. Okay, so you can see a green LED right there. It's probably going a bit grainy now, sorry about that. So we've got, if I block each light curtain, you'll see it should change red. See, that's gone red. That's gone red. That's gone red. And that's gone red, right? So this side is all working. If I do the same lights on this side, so if I do the bottom one, that's gone red. It's gone red. It's gone red. And it has not gone red. That one is not working, okay? So this side is transmitters, these are infrared LEDs, and this side is infrared receivers. So obviously by covering this one means that the one below it is actually sensing, right? Sensing light from somewhere, but not the right one. Because if I cover up this one, it has no effect whatsoever. Although if I cover up both, you know, it's not doing it. There's definitely something weird. I think there might be some kind of light coming through somehow, but it's not great. I don't know. I'm, I'm just thinking something's not right. So I'm getting some weird behaviour with this. Like it could just be the LEDs working, but it's very dim. Because now I've turned these other lights off, it's actually responding. So if I do this one here, oh, I'm kind of in a way of shot, aren't I? Um, yeah, do that one there. So using a screwdriver, that's red there. Come to here. There goes red, that's fine. There goes red. Over here, that one goes red. So now it's actually working. So maybe it is outputting, this is very weak. But the lens on this is also looking a little bit scratched up. So there's the lens and it's looking a bit scratched. Like compared to the next one over, it looks a lot better. Alright, so that's the other one which looks fine. And this one's a bit scratched up and, and damaged maybe that's part of the problem maybe I should just try polishing this up and see if that would be good enough but um, I do have some LEDs to put in here so I'm tempted to try that as well so so much for replacing the LEDs I went away uh, took this transmitter post away because of that damaged lens given that a polish up with a lens cleaning kit for a car because it's quite abrasive you can take scratches out and stuff like that so I use that clean the lens up and now hope you can see it it changes colour when I block that one. That is working. Okay, go to the next one. It's working. This one's working. That one's working. So it gets like cross beams as well. So it's. Yeah, anyway, it's working. So, yay. I don't guess I have to replace the CDs after all. And that's with my lights on as well now. So before that wouldn't do that. You know, I'll cover it up and nothing would happen. Now it is actually working. I think there must be some refraction as well through both of these lenses. Yeah. I'm going to block both of these top LEDs because it does seem to be affecting as well, actually. Yeah. Okay. It's fine. Just need to clean. Hope you found it interesting. Catch you later. That was a pretty short one. Bye.